Hi, I'm Vivian Tan and welcome to Bosch Master Gourmet Series. Today we are going to make a homemade gourmet pasta with a fresh tomato cream sauce. I find that homemade pasta is always going to be better than store-bought because you can be assured of the quality of the ingredients you're using and it absorbs the flavor more easily. You can make this dish easily with the Bosch Maximum Sensor Control Kitchen Machine. This premium kitchen machine is the epitome of Bosch's 60 years of experience in kitchen machine technology. With the strongest motor in the market at 1,600 watts, I feel the need for speed. It comes with an innovative smart dough sensor which adjusts the power. It doesn't slow down with heavy doughs or with big volumes. Let's attach the dough deflector and our kneading hook. Very simply, just push it up like that. We start with five egg yolks, some softened butter, two tablespoons. And I'm going to use a little bit of turmeric powder to give my pasta some color. Let's turn the machine on. We're going to use a rotary switch level three first. Now we're going to add the 400 grams of double O flour. We'll just do it slowly. Let's turn it up a little bit more to seven. Add a little bit of water. Notice how the unique 3D pantry mixing drive works. It reaches all ingredients at the size of the bowl. What we're looking for is a crumbly texture. Perfect. Okay. So there you have our perfect dough. I'm just going to knead this a little bit with my hands just to get it together, as you can see. I'm going to divide this mixture into three balls. This is something that you can do at home with your family, with your friends, get your kids to join you with it. They're going to have a lot of fun. Just take a bit of cling wrap. Now I'm going to set aside and put it in the fridge for about an hour. Let's move on to preparing some vegetables with the continuous shredder. This is so easy to pop out. Get your continuous shredder. This disc has both a fine side and a coarse chopping side. We're going to use the fine for our onions. And I have my onions ready. The beauty about using this, no more tears in the kitchen. No more tears. So for our softer ingredients, like mushrooms, we are going to use the coarse shredder. All you have to do is simply take it out, pop it over. Use speed six. Pop the mushrooms in and wait for the magic to happen. We're done with our mushrooms. Let's go on and create the sauce. We're going to use the jug blender to make an appetizing tomato sauce. So remove the protective cap. We have 750 ml of fresh whole peeled tomatoes. Pop the lid back on, turn the speed to five. a nice smooth consistency. Let's move on to cooking the sauce. So now we move over the stove and we're going to cook our pasta sauce. So let's heat up our stove. Add three tablespoons of olive oil. When the oil is slightly heated up, we can add in our fresh white onions. And I love that sizzle. I'm going to add a couple of bay leaves in. When the onions have softened, add in your garlic. This is the perfect combination, onions and garlic. Ah, heaven. Time to add our blended tomatoes. Let's soak up every little bit of tomatoes inside there. Just stir it through a little bit. We're gonna season with a little pinch of pepper. 
a little pinch of salt, even add a pinch of sugar. This just takes that tartiness, the tang, out of the tomatoes. Mix it through. Mmm, that's gonna be good. Okay, so time to just reduce our sauce, lower the heat and let it simmer. In the meanwhile, I'm gonna make whipped cream. I want to show you a world novelty, the innovative sensor control button. So let's get our whisking attachment. Punch it in, do you hear a click? We're gonna get 300 milliliters chilled whipped cream, pinch of pepper, and a pinch of salt. Close the arm and simply press the button. Perfect results, just like this. Time to get the pasta on. The pasta attachment that we are using today is an optional accessory that you can purchase. But if you don't want to, you could always just use a manual pasta maker like this one here. Let's get started. This is the fun part. So we are going to swing the arm all the way down. Okay. You're going to need a lot of flour and of course the pasta that we made. This has been sitting in the fridge for about an hour. It's nice and soft. Dust the board. Press it down. Okay, I'm gonna turn this first to level one. See how it's getting thinner and thinner? So once you've reached the desired thickness, beautiful, time to switch it off. Okay. Cut it into strips. Delicious fresh pasta. Okay, let's take this over to the stove. We can boil our pasta, finish off our sauce, and eat. And this is where it all happens. We're gonna bring the whole dish together. We have our freshly made pasta. The water is coming to a boil, add a pinch of salt to it. I'm gonna add my softened butter, unsalted. I just find that butter gives us kind of a richness, I know. Sinful, but sinfully good. So once our onions have cooked through, let's wait for them to soften. I'm gonna add some bacon. I love the crunch of bacon. If you don't eat pork, then maybe you could use turkey bits. Pasta is a really great dish. You can combine any different types of vegetables and meats inside there. So many different types of pastas. And now you know how to make your own homemade, fresh, gourmet pasta with, of course, the wonderful kitchen machines from Bosch. You can just go crazy in the kitchen. Mushrooms. I'm gonna cook the mushrooms through as well. These are our shredded mushrooms that we did a little bit earlier. Okay. Now the pasta water is boiling. While it's doing that, I'm just gonna quickly pop in our pomodoro, our tomato sauce. Mmm, that's really coming together well now. Here's our beautiful homemade pasta. Pop it into the boiling water. It only takes a couple of minutes to cook this through. Pasta is looking good. The sauce is looking good. Okay, the pasta is now cooked. Let's strain it. I'm going to toss it through. I'm just going to add our spinach leaves. Okay, smelling good. We're going to sprinkle a little bit of Parmesan cheese. On the top, and that delectable whipped cream that we made earlier. Mmm, that smells so good. And then just mix that beautiful whipped cream together with the delicious, rich pomodoro sauce. Mmm. So easy with the Bosch Maximum Sensor Control kitchen machine. Bon appetit!